Here's how you can add rounded corners to your videos. This works for both vertical and horizontal layouts. I'll do vertical for this example. With my video clip on the timeline, I'll go to effects and search for crop by padding. Drag it onto the clip and increase the radius to round out the corners. The higher the value, the rounder the corners. You can also make a circle by checking this checkbox at the top here. Play around with the radius to resize your circle. You can also create keyframes to animate the rounding of your corners or the size of your circle. But wait, there's more. You can control the position and size of your crop. This does not apply to the circle, however, so I'll uncheck that. You can change the width and height separately or together by clicking on this chain to lock the aspect ratio. You also have the size down here. You can use the align button for quick alignment or manually change the position with the X and Y values. Although changing the size this way does crop more into your videos. So you could add a transform to scale down the crop instead. Last but not least, you can control the background color or padding color using the color selector or color picker. By default, it is set to transparency. So increase the alpha to make the color visible. Bonus tip, once you're done, you can use my drop shadow template to add a drop shadow to your crop. This only works if you place the drop shadow stack at the very end of the effect stack and leave the padding color transparent. In other words, leave the alpha to zero. And click on this playlist here for more Kid in Live tutorials. Thanks for watching.